Hi guys, it's Sam, and if you notice a change in the video quality, hopefully it's for the better. I got a new phone, and it's going to be part of a haul video that I'll do sometime next week, I think, because I got some fun stuff to share with you. But I got the Samsung Galaxy S10, which is just an upgrade from the Samsung Samsung X9 that I had before and I was able to upgrade so I'm really excited and I love how pictures come out on this phone and hopefully the video quality is better and in this video I am going to be doing the March Mishi box unboxing and this is Korean beauty products it's just it's a subscription service and I'm just so excited to get these. My sister got it for me as a Christmas present and I'm getting six months. So it started in December and I think it goes up to May. And then she told me so, so that I wouldn't get it for myself. She's going to extend it for my birthday, which is in June. And I'm so excited. It's like getting a gift every month. And I just love trying Korean products. It, it's kind of like what Mimi Box used to be. But now I don't think Mimi Box does boxes anymore, which was kind of disappointing they started to just sell like single products if you wanted and anyway this is an amazing box and I have seen the stuff in here before because I tried to film this video several times yesterday and it just wasn't working out so I am just gonna do it right now and I thought I would show you um, I was trying to film it like I showed you the products first and then I would I would read about it but then I just was like I'm, I'm telling you the same thing twice so I'm gonna show you this this is the paper that comes in the box and it just tells you the products and the first thing it talks about is the milky dress oasis peeling gel so let me find that it comes like this it's a huge box I love it you get full-size products in here and most of the time you get full-size products. You'll always get like one or two. So this is what it looks like. And it says here on the, the paper, it gently removes dead skin cells to visibly improve skin complexion. And it says to use about one to two times weekly. And the retail price is $18. Oh, and another thing, guys, I noticed when I, I was just checking out my video, YouTube page and I never, I'm never wearing lipstick. And I'm always wearing a hoodie. So I decided to put, and also my hair is up. So I decided to put my hair down, add a little lipstick, and just change it up a little bit. Because I was like, wow, I like what I like. Okay, next product is the Eggplant Bubble Pad from Gramolin. is a super convenient one-step cleansing pad. And it looks like this. And when exposed to air, it bubbles up for effective cleansing and one pad is enough to remove makeup and cleanse your skin. I'm kind of excited about this because I've been looking for, I don't know, I've just not been liking the way that I've been removing my makeup. I, I want something more simple, one step, and right now I have to do a few steps, especially for eye makeup. So I'm excited to try that. And then we have next the Gramolin day by day creams so this one is oh and you know how much was that eggplant egg that eggplant thing was five dollars this day cream is where is that thing? looks like this i love the packaging it's so simple and the one i got is sorry it's turning everything yellow or beigey uh this is the moist ice cream i love that that is so cute and it's number one so it's I don't want it to change color anymore, so I'll keep that down. But it says here, since I got the first one, the moist ice cream, or the number one, uh, the moist ice cream contains beta glucan, aloe vera leaf extract, and sodium hyaluronate to moisturize dry skin. And this one was $21, and you could have gotten random. You could have gotten... Two, which was the V5 Multivita Care a cream, three, the collagen repair cream, and four, the Sika Solution cream. So I would have been happy with any of those, but I'm glad to have another day cream. I always like to have a backup of a day cream. And sorry if my eyes right over here, oh, eyelash got in there. Okay, next product is the ReDNA Galactic. Galactomyces ampule. 
this box, March box, I felt like I was reading a science book. The words on here, whew. All right, so it's a dropper kind of thing. Looks like this, and I don't know, I feel like it's been used just because it's so, there's so much of on the top that's not full of product. Anyway, it says here, this is a mini size. And the retail, oh, the retail price of the cream, sorry guys, I'm just not remembering because I'm trying something new in this video. So that Gramoline Day by Day Care Cream was $21. And then this thing right here, the Read DNA, is $10. And this is the mini size. And it's supposed to, let's see, promote skin elasticity, brighten skin, minimize the appearance of pores, moisturize skin, and smooth skin. Now, Ampules, it's, you know, it's part of the Korean, you know, 10-step beauty regimen. And it's just a lot. I'm always confused about essences, boosters, ampules. So I think it's, I'm looking at my, cause I have this. This is the Korean step, 10 step skincare. And you can see it's at number six. But the thing is I have serum, I have a serum. So it's like, what do I use? When do I use it? So it's a little confusing sometimes. So if any of you are experts on Korean skincare and the steps, when do I use this? And then, the last thing is the Hyla Hyla Lu Aqua Pack Mask from Dr. Smith or Esmus, and it is made with ultra thin transparent mask sheet that adheres to your skin like no other to deliver moisture effectively. Its main ingredients are hyaluronic acid and EGF, which helps increase moisture and improve skin elasticity. And this is two. Two dollars and fifty cents, and the I like this box a lot of skincare products, which I am into right now. But I was kind of disappointed they didn't add a makeup product in here, which the last couple of boxes, actually it was just December and January, they had I had gotten a lipstick, and then another box was a mascara, which was kind of exciting to try a Korean makeup. But this is more skincare focused these boxes, but I really like them, and I'm excited to I've used a few products from. Uh, from the boxes that I've gotten but I'm trying to use up a lot of stuff before I open up something else and I I do have to say I like these boxes this one was not my favorite but also it's like you know I'm still excited to try these things and yeah that is my Mishi box for March I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you got this box and what your thoughts on it were and I hope you guys are all doing well and I'll talk to you soon Bye.